Hello, welcome back to another video and today I'll be showing you a pretty classic, classic magic trick. So first, you take a deck of cards and then you ask the spectator to choose any card in the deck. In this case, it's the 10 of diamonds. Next, you give the spectator a pen and they sign the card with your signature. Then, then um, you take the card and you take your pen back and then you stab the card with the pen and they can really they can actually see it and you can visually see the pen has gone through the card but of course as the magician you can easily just restore the card and the pen so as you can see the sign spectator's card no longer has a hole in it and after the trick the pen and uh, and the card can be fully examined here's a tutorial for this trick you'll need two things you'll need a pack of cards and then you'll need this magic pen this is indeed a gimmick pen the deck is no more though this pen actually has two sides one of the sides has a magnetic end as you can see and the other end is completely legitimate. When the spectator signs the card, they use the legitimate side. So then, uh, signing the card, signing the card makes uh, in the spectator psychologically think that the pen is legitimate. Like normally, a spectator wouldn't assume the pen is gimmicked. There are uh, the original trick. This original classic trick was originally made with uh, for stabbing dollar bills, but. Like, I like to do it with playing cards because playing cards, they're smaller, they're more portable. And like, you don't, most people don't want to sign a dollar bill, but you can let them sign a card. And it just reinforces the fact how it's a real pen. Now to the technique, uh, these pens can be bought probably from Amazon or any other store, online store, or even a magic shop even. So now we're going to get to the technique. So, uh, in this case I brought the pen off camera but the, it's really easy you can just ask the spectator to uh, just use some misdirection just talk with the spectator where you can do this technique which is very pretty pretty simple so right here is the magnetic side which is the gimmick side so all you're gonna do is you're gonna pull off and then pull off the magnetic tip of the pen like this so now, to the normal eye, it just looks like you grabbed the pen and picked up the card. But in reality, you pulled off the magnetic, uh, magnetic tip. To do this, just use the card as a cover. So from the magician's point of view, all you're doing is just using your three fingers to grab the magnetic piece and covering the tip of the pen with your fist. Try not to do this because it makes, makes it look like the tip is gone. Just move the pen a bit like that, so it looks more legitimate. I do the move one more time, like this. And when you do it faster and from the spectator's point of view, the card will be blocking off the action, so they won't know. The next step's easy. Just, just hit, uh, hit the card and make a pop sound like this, so it looks like it uh, penetrates the card. And the tip will automatically stick to the pen so the work's done for you after that you can just use some magic oh shoot not like that <laughs> no so you can the next trick is you can just pull off the pen like that it's a very easy trick uh, when you give out the pen for spectating just give the pen out like that palm palm the fake tip put it in your pocket but don't do it like that obviously but like yeah, so they, yeah, sorry, never mind. So then basically just take the tip and just give them the pen and they can inspect it. It's a completely normal pen. You can also inspect the card and the deck. Here's a bonus trick you can do with the pen. So first you ask your friends that they will be wrong five times in a row, even though they have a 50-50% chance. Then they'll say, okay, sure, I bet I can win. So basically all you're going to ask them is, is the pen capped or uncapped? Obviously, because there's two ends to the pen, they'll always be wrong. For example, if they think the pen is capped, you just do this and say, oops, sorry, it's uncapped, you lose. If they say the pen 
is uncapped, then you just show, oh, so sorry, it is capped. And then you win every single time. And of course, you can just pull off the magnetic tip and show your friends a pen. So that's a little fun trick that I like doing with my friends. So hopefully you enjoyed the video and peace out.